we've had people, I, I've had people crying down the phone to me saying, I just can't stay in my house because my senior freeze payment's been canceled. And it's really difficult for people to live if they don't get these payments. Finance attorney Peter Humphrey says thousands of senior citizens and disabled residents will be driven out of their homes if they don't receive property tax relief under the state's senior freeze property tax relief program. The thing that it works is that um, for those who are eligible, and there are different eligibility requirements um, based on income, the number of years that you've lived in New Jersey, um, and the number of years that you've lived in your home, um, it establishes a base year, and once you become eligible, your property taxes are in effect frozen at that level. And then as each successive year comes, um, if your property taxes increase, you get reimbursed for the difference between that base year and what the property tax bill currently is. In June, Governor Murphy cut funding for both Senior Freeze and Homestead Benefit, another tax relief program for seniors. Funding wasn't included in the stopgap budget he signed this summer, but the money was restored in the new state budget that went into effect October 1st. The back and forth has left seniors in limbo with delayed checks and confusion over whether to fill out the application this year. Qualified recipients of the Senior Freeze um, did receive those reimbursement checks earlier in the calendar year. And yes, of course, um, those reimbursement checks, which can co total into the, in the hundreds, if not thousands of dollars, uh, certainly help uh, those families put food on the table, keep the lights on. It was mixed messages out there. I still have seniors calling me and saying, are we gonna get our relief? Ellen Steinberg, chair of the Senior Citizen Council, says despite the program being active, there are still thousands of confused seniors. They're trying to reach to make sure they get the application in on time. Last week, Governor Murphy extended the deadline to apply from November 2nd to December 31st. Steinberg says that's a welcome development since many seniors were scrambling to meet the original date. What's the average property tax in New Jersey? Almost $9,000. And a lot of these seniors are just living on Social Security. Approximately 40% of the people live just on their Social Security check. So they may be looking at a check for $1,200, $1,500, $1,600 a month, maybe fifteen, twenty thousand dollars $20,000 a year, and they've got to pay nine, ten dollars plus thousands of dollars in property tax to remain in their house. Steinberg and her husband say even with the extended deadline, they are urging seniors to prepare their application as soon as possible. For NJ Spotlight News, I'm Raven Santana.